Bombastic. Bombastic? Oh no, Jimmy, did you just get a TikTok sound? You have to say the rest of the sound. Answer carefully because if you answer it wrong, you die. Bombastic. They call me Mr. Bombastic. Bomba fantastic. No, Jimmy! It was Bombastic sign I. Are you off to school, honey? Yeah, Grandma. <laughs> We need cash. Why am I hearing voices? Oh no, Grandma, did you just get a TikTok sound? You have to say the rest of it. We need cash. Give me my money, you world. Grandma! <laughs> Grandma! I'm on a Mexican radio. Hey girl, how are you doing today? Not good. My grandma couldn't finish the rest of the TikTok sound this morning. I said him. Brianna, what's wrong? I just got a TikTok sound. I said a... Come on, you have to say the rest of the sound. I said a boom. Come on, hurry. I'm trying to think. I said a boom, chicka, boom. I said a boom, chicka, rocka, chicka, rocka, chicka, boom. I got it. I'm so glad you're safe. Come on, let's go to class. Okay. Okay. What is this? You just got a TikTok sound, didn't you? I know this one. What are you doing? What were we just about to do? I think I know the rest of the sound. Okay, let's go to class. <laughs> no! It was okay, let's go. There's my beautiful girlfriend. What's wrong, baby? My best friend couldn't say the TikTok sound correctly. I think I'm just gonna go home early today. One, two, one, two. I just got a TikTok sound. One, two. Babe, I know the answer for this one. One, two. Buckle my shoe. No, babe, you're not allowed to give the answer. You're only allowed to give a hint. I forgot. <laughs> Baby. Answer now or be eliminated. One, two. Buckle my shoe. Three, four. Buckle some more. Five, six. Nike kicks. Where do you think you're going? Ow. Ow. Jump scare. I'm going home. No, you're not allowed to leave the school without a note from your mother. My boyfriend just passed away. That's not my problem. Now go to class. Mommy, look what I can do. What the? Mommy? Mommy, that's not something you should be calling one of your students. No, it's a tic tac sound. Mommy, look what I can do. Hey, look what I can do. What are you doing? I'm giving you a hint. It's an audio from this amazing POV Girls video. I don't know the answer. She must be a nobody. It was Ewa Ewa. The principal's gone. That means I can finally go home. No, you can't go. You have to learn. Let me go, Eugene. Side eye. Side eye? Did you just get a TikTok sound? You're not smart enough to guess it right. <laughs> Side eye. Let her go, Eugene. Timmy. Let's get out of here. Thanks for getting me out of there, Timmy. Eugene is really weird. It was no problem. Anyways, I'm heading home now. You know what it never was? I just got a TikTok sound. You know what it never was? Uh, that's serious. It was never that serious. Timmy, you got it. I'm safe. Anyways, I'll see you later. Bye. You're not going anywhere. Frick. You're not going anywhere. Frick. Frick. This is going to be a problem, isn't it? Timmy, please just let me go home. I want to see my family. At least you have a home, a family. Everyone I know and love is gone because they couldn't say the TikTok sound correctly. If I don't get to see my family again, neither do you. Say bye-bye, Brianna. Ashley! Ashley? I just got a TikTok sound. Give me a hint now. Ashley, look at the floor. Ashley, look at the floor. You really thought I'd give you the right hint, Timmy? It was Ashley, look at me. There you are, now get to class. Just leave me alone, Eugene. Okay, well, that's interesting. You need to learn. Okay, well, that's interesting. You know why? Why? Because, honey, you're home early. Mom, today's been the worst day. When is this game gonna end? Happy, happy, happy. Oh no. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. I'm not doing it, I'm not happy. If you hear, if you're happy and you know it, you must do whatever she says happily. If you don't do what she says with a smile, 
you'll die. That's scary. <laughs> if you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. It's 7 a.m., bro. It's too early for this. Uh-oh. Chad wasn't happy and you know it. <laughs> Chad. Brittany, are you okay? I know Chad was your boyfriend. If you're happy and you know it, cut your hair. I love cutting my hair. So happy. So happy. <laughs> no, my beautiful hair. Aw, Brittany wasn't happy and you know it. If you're happy and you know it, push someone down the stairs. If you're happy and you know it, push someone down the stairs. Hello, Brianna. Principal Stevens, you can go down the stairs first. How kind of you. Principal Stevens? Principal Stevens? I think I killed him. If you're happy and you know it, say hooray. Hooray! Are you okay? You look worried. My boyfriend is not going to be happy with me. I killed his dad. Principal Stevens? How could you? You killed my dad? Babe, wait. Please just listen to me. I didn't have a choice. I got happy and you know it to push someone down the stairs. I didn't know he'd die. Why would you choose my dad? If you're happy and you know it, break up with your boyfriend. Babe, we have to break up. You just got a happy and you know it, didn't you? That's funny. I just got one to kill you. Jake, you wouldn't actually do it, right? You wouldn't kill me. I would. Happily. Bree Bree, where are you? If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. <laughs> Found you. This is for my dad. Jake? Uh-oh, Jake took too long to complete his happy and you know it. <gasps> Jake, are you still alive? <coughs> Not for much longer. I'm so cold. Here, take this sweater. You gave it to me. You should have it back anyways. I really did love you, Jake. I... I love you. If you're happy and you know it, kill your teacher with this apple. Apple? Look in your pocket. If you're happy and you know it, kill your teacher with this apple. Apple? Look in your pocket. Miss Applewood, I got you an apple because you're my favorite teacher. Are you hungry? Thank you. You can just leave it on the desk, Brianna. Miss Applewood, you've been working really hard. You should really take a bite. Okay, I will. I am a little hungry. It's actually pretty... <gasps> Where's Miss Applewood? Class started 10 minutes ago. If she's not here in 15 minutes, legally we can leave. If you're happy and you know it, throw your pen at Eugene. Ow! Why would you... Is it just me, or are we getting a lot more happy and you know it's recently? I'm not. I've only gotten one today. Brianna, you know if you're getting a lot of happy and you know it, it means they're trying to eliminate you, right? If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, put your hands in the air. Principal Stevens, you're alive? If you're happy and you know it, kill your teacher with this apple. Apple? Look in your pocket. Miss Applewood, I got you an apple because you're my favorite teacher. Are you hungry? Thank you. You can just leave it on the desk, Brianna. Miss Applewood, you've been working really hard. You should really take a bite. Okay, I will. I am a little hungry. It's actually pretty... <gasps> Where's Miss Applewood? Class started 10 minutes ago. If she's not here in 15 minutes, legally we can leave. If you're happy and you know it, throw your pen at Eugene. Ow! Why would you... Is it just me, or are we getting a lot more happy and you know it's recently? I'm not. I've only gotten one today. Brianna, you know if you're getting a lot of happy and you know it, it means they're trying to eliminate you, right? If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, put your hands in the air. Principal Stevens, you're alive? <laughs> Mommy, I have hearts all over my face. Oh, you got your hearts, but you only have three. Those hearts represent the amount of times you're allowed to be heartbroken. Every time someone breaks your heart, you lose one of your hearts. So what happens if I have no hearts left? You die. <gasps> hey, besties. <clears throat> Pizza face. <laughs> Jake, stop it. You can't sit with us. Everyone's looking at you because of all your pimples on your face. It's embarrassing. It's just a little breakout. I've been really stressed recently. You can't sit with us. Is my acne really that bad? <gasps> a heart's missing. That means they broke my heart. 
Hey, babe. Bro, what's all over your face? Yeah, babe, what happened? It's just pimples. It will go away. <laughs> That's your girl, bro? She's not my girl. I'm not. I only have one heart left. I can't get heartbroken again. I know what to do. I only have one heart left. I can't get heartbroken again. I know what to do. Whoa, Brianna looks hot. Hey, girl, come sit with us. Yesterday, when you said I couldn't sit with you guys, you made me lose a heart. I can't trust you guys won't break my heart again. You never even deserved it in the first place. Babe, you look so good today. I'm not your babe. Yesterday, you didn't want to be with me because I had pimples. You made me lose a heart. I only have one left because of you. I can't trust you won't break my heart again. I'm sorry. Class, we have a new student today. Everyone meet John. You can sit wherever you like, John. Hey, can I sit here? Sure, do whatever you want. Lucky me. I get to sit next to the prettiest girl in the class. Look, I'm not interested. I can't risk getting involved with another person again. Hey, wait, why did you say you can't risk getting involved with another person? I only have one heart left. If I get heartbroken again, I'll die. I only have one heart left too. How about we take the risk together? I only have one heart left. If I get heartbroken again, I'll die. I only have one heart left too. How about we take the risk together? Okay, let's try it then. But just know, if you break my heart, you'll be considered a murderer. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, babe. Hey, can I ask what happens to your other hearts? How'd they get broken? My best friends and boyfriend broke my heart because they didn't like the way I looked. You may not notice, but I have really bad acne under all this makeup. That's so superficial. I would never do that to you. Wow, you're so strong and muscular. <laughs> Thanks. I want to kiss you. Brittany, I... Why would you- John? It's not what it looks like. Brianna, she came on to me. I saw you. You kissed her. You don't have any hearts left. Brianna! Good, you're awake. How am I alive? Where's John? Who do you think gave you the heart? He gave you his last one. Mommy, are we almost at the ice cream shop? <laughs> <laughs> Hurry, cover your mouth and nose. Come on, sweetie. We have to get out of here now. Huh? Mommy, why did you tell me to get out of there? I thought we were getting ice cream. If you hear laughing, you must cover your nose and mouth with the cloth I gave you. This cloth was created to fight against the laughing disease. Laughing is highly contagious and incurable. If you catch it, you'll die. Mommy, why didn't you wake me up for school? <laughs> Mommy? <laughs> Help! Help someone! Sweetie, what's going on? Why are you outside? Mommy's inside. She has the laughing disease. Don't worry, sweetie. I'll take care of mommy. Good morning, Dad. I'm off to school now. Ha 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 ha. Dad? Ha 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 ha. Good morning, Dad. I'm off to school now. Ha 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 ha. Dad? Ha 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 ha. How's my best friend today? My dad has a laughing disease. That means both my parents are gone. I can't go home tonight. Do you think I can stay at your place? I have to go. Where are you going? Your dad has the laughing disease. You could have caught it. I can't risk it. Stay away. Class, does anyone know the answer to? <laughs> Everyone out. Students, stay out here. I'll take care of Miss Applewood. That was so scary. Are you doing okay, Bree? I thought you didn't want me near you in case I'm contagious. I know what I said. I was just worried. <laughs> Babe, is everything okay? Jake, it, it's my best friend, Sophie. She has the laughing disease. We have to get rid of her. <laughs> You're laughing. No, no, I'm fine, I'm fine. My best friend, Sophie, she has the laughing disease. We have to get rid of her. <laughs> You're laughing. No, no, I'm fine, I'm fine. Please, please, I don't have it. I don't have the laughing disease. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I'm laughing. Goodbye, world. <laughs> Brianna, stop. Stop laughing if you want to live. Stop what? Were you laughing? No, no. I was just practicing in case I did catch the laughing disease. The laughing disease is incurable. If you catch it, you're doomed. Now get to class. <laughs> stop stop laughing i knew it i knew you had the laughing disease say bye bye brianna no no i'm not infected i'm telling you say bye bye brianna no no i'm not infected i'm telling you look at my face 
I'm not laughing. No, I saw you. You were laughing. You must have been seeing things. <laughs> tell me. <laughs> tell me the cure for the laughing disease. <laughs> I, I don't know. Let go of me. Come with us, Brianna. Where am I? Who are you? What do you want from me? We need to know how you got cured from the laughing disease. What's the secret? Look, I don't know how I cured the disease. If I knew, I'd tell you. Let me see your arm. What are you doing? We're injecting you with the laughing disease so we can know your secret. No! <laughs> Everyone, put your mask on so you don't catch the laughing disease. She's laughing too much. We have to get rid of her or else we'll catch the laughing disease. Have you guys ever thought that maybe the laughing disease isn't deadly? You just kill everyone who gets it because you're afraid. <laughs> please give me white, please give me white. Red. <laughs> I didn't even know that was an option. I don't know if red's my color. What are you wearing? My assigned color. Put on this white shirt immediately. Okay, jeez. No one can know you've been assigned red. As far as anyone knows, your color's white. Got it? OMG Bestie, you also got assigned white? Yes, we're twins! Oh no, a group of reds is coming. We have to go immediately. Wait, why? Just go. Don't make eye contact. Uh, okay, I don't understand what's so bad about red. Everyone come in line for your color check. Make sure you have on your proper color. We'll know if you're lying. I, I have to go. Wait, we have color check. I'm on my period. You are not going anywhere. Why do you have on white? It, it's my color. No, it's not. Your color is blue? It's okay, you don't need to be ashamed. It's red. Oh no, I need to go. You are going to a place where all the other liars go. No. Get in there with all your other liar friends. So you guys all got assigned red too, huh? I'm Maria. Jake. Does anyone actually know what red means? It means we're a danger to society. My best friend got assigned white. She's terrified of me. I don't understand why she knows me. Reds are known to go after those assigned white. Their pure-hearted kindness makes them an easy target. I'm so tired. Are they going to give us anything to drink or eat? You may all come out now. If you ever lie about your color again, you will be eliminated from society. All right, red team. Let's go. I'm not going to go. I need to find my bestie. Wait. I really don't think that's a good idea. You don't know her like I do. Bestie, there you are. I've been looking everywhere for you. Oh no, stay away from me. Where are you going? Why are you running? Stop running from me. Get away from me, you psycho red. I'm not red. I'm your best friend. You don't trust me? Somebody help me. This crazy red is after me. So, did you find her? Yeah, I did. Looks like it went really well. <laughs> hey. The other Reds and I are gonna go vandalize some stuff. You wanna come? Honestly, I'd love to. <laughs> I've never had this much fun in my entire life. Being a Red isn't so bad after all, is it? No, it really isn't. Oh no. What was that? It's the police! Run! That was insane. I have never run from the cops before. Being a Red, it's something that will happen often. I meant to ask you, why did you originally lie about being red? You seem so proud of it. I knew my parents would disown me if they found out, so I pretended. But now the secret's out. I can never go back. It's okay. You'll always have us. Alright friends, what is the plan next? Look over there. A bunch of people assigned white. Let's get them. This is gonna be so much fun. Let's go. Brianna, are you coming? What? No! Stop! Leave them alone! I can't believe you guys did that. You attacked them. It's our nature. It's what we do. We're reds. It's wrong. You're one of us now, okay? You need to start acting like it. I'm nothing like you. I'll never be like any of you. Where's your red? From here on out, I have no assigned color. Put on red. They're gonna send you to jail. Or worse, execute you. No, I don't fit in with any of these assigned colors. Therefore, I have no color. Hello, Brianna. I'm gonna need you to come with me. It's the president! Hey, leave her alone. Calm down there, fella. I would just like to speak with her. Jake, it's fine. I'll go with him. Have some tea. Thank you. I thought that we may have an issue with you. You see, you're the only person to show strong attributes of all three colors. We chose red because we thought it would best suit you, since you are going to be quite the danger to us. How are you enjoying your tea so far? 
Why do I feel so dizzy? Yeah, we're going to need you to sleep for a little while. What? Where am I? Good morning, Brianna. I'd like to make a deal with you. You have two options. Either I banish you from society for all eternity. No. Or we change your assigned color to white. You can do that? Yes, but you must always fit the mold. Always kind, never dangerous. Failure to do so, you will be banished. No second chances. Hey, leave her alone, jerk. Jake? Maria? Look over there. It's a distraction. Run! Do you really want to live this way? A social reject? An embarrassment to your family? Brianna, don't listen to him. We'll tell everyone that we made a mistake. That you were always meant to be assigned white. Brianna, no! I'm sorry. It's the only option. I have to go with him. I knew it. You were always meant to be assigned white. What was it like, hanging out with those horrifying reds? They're literally insane! Don't talk that way about my friends! You can't be friends with them. They're assigned red. It's way too dangerous. Well, I am, and they're my friends. My real friends. I need to find them. Hey. What are you doing here, traitor? Would you guys please just let me explain myself? We're listening. I was only given two options. Either I'm banished from society for all eternity, or I change my assigned color to white. You still could have came with us. We would have protected you. You're meant to be red, not white. That's the thing. I don't fit in with any of the colors. There's no color I'm meant to be. What? That's impossible. But I have an idea. She's assigned white and she's sitting with reds? Has she lost her mind? Psst, Bessie, what are you doing over there? Come here. No, they're my friends. This whole color system is ridiculous. And it's about time somebody did something about it. <gasps> Where did this kiss mark come from? Someone must have kissed your soulmate's cheek. Anything that touches your soulmate's face becomes permanent on yours. So you're saying a random girl's kiss mark is going to be on my face forever? It's really not coming off. Yeah, that's kind of how permanent works. I'm going to send him a message. Is that an angry face emoji? That'll be on his face forever. Not my problem. He should have thought about that before he kissed a girl who wasn't his soulmate. Brianna, you have something on your face. That must be from my soulmate. I think he's trying to tell me he's sorry. I should forgive him. What are you putting on your face now? It's my address. I'm going to put it on my face so my soulmate can find me. You shouldn't give him your address. You don't even know him. What if he's dangerous? Come on, it's my soulmate. You really think he'd be dangerous? <gasps> that must be my soulmate. Did you send your address to Mr. James? <gasps> that must be my soulmate. <laughs> Did you send your address? To Mr. James, you made a big mistake. Your address is permanently on Mr. James' face. He will have to wear a mask from now on. I'm really sorry. I wasn't thinking. I just really wanted to meet my soulmate. If you try and contact him again, you'll pay. Yes, sir. Brianna, you got another mark on your face from your soulmate. Oh, it's Hard Eyes. Did you meet him? No, some big scary guy came to my house saying, If you try to contact Mr. James, you'll pay. The Mr. James? Who? No one's ever seen Mr. James before, but allegedly he's the son of one of the most dangerous mafia bosses in the world. Brianna, look at your face. He must need help. What should I do? Nothing. It's dangerous. Come with me. Be beautiful or be popular? I've always wanted to be beautiful. <laughs> Honey, I always thought you were beautiful. No one else thinks so, Mom. It's still loading? <coughs> Ugly loser! Do us a favor and walk around with a bag over your head. Just, just you guys wait! I chose to be beautiful! I'm going to be the most beautiful girl in the school! <laughs> There's no way that you could ever be beautiful. I am going to be beautiful. That's what I chose. I'm the most beautiful girl in the school. There's no way you'd ever look better than me. Let's make a deal. When you become beautiful, if you can get Chad to go to prom with you over me, then I'll believe you. Deal. I like your shirt, Brianna. Really? <laughs> Thank you. Ew, why is Chad talking to ugly Brianna? <laughs> I'll talk to you again once I'm beautiful. Huh? It stopped loading. Didn't work. Nothing's changed. It stopped loading. It didn't work. Nothing's changed. Hey. Brianna, stop. I want to ask you something. Oh, you were talking to me. I wanted to ask you if you wanted to be my date to prom. 
<laughs> yes! Well, well, looks like ugly Brianna is still ugly. It says I should be beautiful now, but it didn't work. Chad did ask me to prom, though. You can't go to prom with Chad. He's the hottest guy in the school, and you're ugly. You can only go with him if you become beautiful, or if you wear a bag over your head. Chad, we shouldn't go to prom together. Just wait. I should be beautiful any time now. What are you talking about? I chose to be beautiful. It finally stopped loading, but nothing changed. Brianna, nothing changed because you've always been beautiful. What? I chose to be beautiful. It finally stopped loading, but nothing changed. Brianna, nothing changed because you've always been beautiful. What? I've thought you were beautiful since the first time I laid eyes on you. No, you're just saying that to be nice. I'm not. I really mean it. <laughs> Thank you. I should go. I have to get to class. Brianna, look at yourself. You look beautiful. I look beautiful, but I don't even look like me. I'm going back to the way I was before. Is there something wrong with your brain? Why would you go back to looking ugly? Because she was never ugly. Chad, I don't get it. I'm the most beautiful girl in the school. Why did you choose her to go to prom with over me? You are beautiful. <laughs> On the outside. But inside, you're ugly. Come on, Brianna. Okay.